just wanted to give a little information for anybody that's getting the note or has the note and is wondering if they want to root it. But really, I just wanted to tell you that I've rooted a lot of phones in the past. It's a very, very stressful thing to do unless you really know what you're doing and I didn't. And some of the reasons that I would root in the past was, you know, maybe to have a better operating system because we weren't getting the updates or to have um, a better, a, you know, better features, a better camera or to have like, I know when HTC came out with being able to la launch tasks in the lock screen, Ugh. it was, it, that was so awesome and I wanted that or, you know, just, um, for a better processor to have it be overclocked or a better kernel um to be able to take screenshots even though this takes screenshots and it also records whoops <laughs> um also a big thing with me was i you know the way samsung's so chintzy on their resolution on my infuse i wanted a smaller resolution and this also um while everything is so nice on this phone it could have been the print could have been smaller, but luckily you have the choice to change the font. So I used a font that's kind of small font to begin with. And then on top of that, I chose tiny so that it would be, you know, pretty small, which I don't think you can tell, but it's kind of, you know, it's, sh it's shrunk down. You're really not able to see, but anyway, and you know, so just wanted to, um, put my vote in for not rooting because and um, this is nothing against ROMing or rooting because, I mean, that's all I've thought about for the past two, two and a half years, so far be it for me to criticize. I, I enjoyed it so much, even though I found it so stressful because so many of my devices were bought outright. <laughs> and I never did mess any of them up. Well, I messed two up. Um, most recently, I messed up a tablet, but that wasn't really my fault because it had an ice cream bug ice cream sandwich bug that I didn't know about and uh, I also messed up a um, a view pad a few about two years ago I, I, I couldn't get it out of recovery but I rooted at least 20 phones so not the worst track record but uh, what I just did want to say was that you know there's so many positive things going for this phone and it's, it's really top of the line everything at this time, so really what you would have to gain by rooting it probably isn't that, you know, all that much of an advantage. And one of the things that's really, and, and this is just one girl's opinion, and I really am no expert by no means, but one thing that I found is that it's getting pretty complicated in here, and really the more complicated it gets and the more you know, that Android advances, I think the more you really need to know what you're doing. Because I remember when I first rooted my Vibrant, I mean, I used to throw kernels in there. I didn't even know what I was doing. I would just flash everything and anything and nothing ever went wrong, ever. And then as we started getting more complicated with um, gingerbread and uh, other operating systems and Voodoo Lag Fix and, you know, just lots of different things, I started having problems, not not things that, you know, bricked it completely, but definitely like things that had never happened before when I was on Froyo and using all the earlier developments in Android. So I'm not sure if it's that it's getting more complicated or if there's just too much bad information out there or what, but really, um, I just wanted to, like I said, you know, advise anybody that is kind of where I'm at, which is definitely novice, that this phone is so unbelievable in every way, shape, or form. I cannot say enough amazing things about it. Rooting, well, I don't even know why I'm making this video, because the second that y'all get your hands on it and play with it and whatever, you'll be like, I do not need to root this. So this video, I guess, is kind of pointless. Plus... Um, I doubt that I'll put it up on YouTube because I hate videos with my face in it, but all the other videos that I've made, everybody complains to me that the only thing they occasionally get to see my face is in a reflection. 
So I thought I'd give y'all a real treat and put my face in this video. But anyway, so that's it for now. Uh, just wanted to share that info with y'all. Bye now.